The purpose of this demo is to show you how to consume raw materials from a location of your choosing in the production process. So let's first go look at the inventory here, look at an inventory report. We see of the uh, linen, we have it in 72 units in warehouse stock. Let's create a quick uh, internal transfer to move from stock to uh, supplier two, um, linen in the quantity of, uh, we'll do 10 units. Oops, and we'll just say 10 units. So now when we look at our stock, you will see for linen we have 62 in stock uh, and then 10 in supplier two location, which we can of course, when we bring it in, we can define which supplier it goes to automatically um, without a problem. Now, let's go manufacture, create, and a manufacturing order for nine units. And you'll see here, I can control where I, which supplier I pull this linen from. And I'll do nine units from supplier two, check availability, produce, right? We're consuming the nine units from supplier two, mark is done. Now we'll see here when I go to my inventory reporting uh, here, we have one unit left at supplier two's location. And of course, if I just go forward and create a manufacturing order for this uh, for one unit, it will pull just from generic a generic stock location um, going forward, as we'll see here. And now I had, uh, I believe it was 72, I should have 71 in stock now. Or excuse me, 63, I have 62 now, which makes sense. Okay, so that's how that would work. Let me know if you have any additional questions at all, and I'll be more than happy to uh, drill into detail. Thank you.